recordings um, and that we're all obviously enjoying the sultry ambience of the temperature. Wow. I'll get straight into it. Um, my name's Harriet Shing. I'm a Member of Parliament for Eastern Victoria Region. It is so lovely to join you here this morning to join so many people uh, who live, work and breathe the La Trobe Valley. In particular, uh, Mayor Councillor Kelly O'Callaghan, Sharon Gibson. It is so lovely to see you, to see Daryl, to see um, to see Alan, to see Graham up the back and Sharon. Did I mention you already? I beg of you, get two mentions. Um, and it is fantastic to see um, players, volunteers and management from the footy uh, club, the soccer league here in Gippsland has made the most profound found impact on the way in which we run our sports here and participation is absolutely the key. We have a really great sporting culture here in Gippsland and it's been really, really important that we make sure that that continues into the future. So along with the Football Federation of Victoria and various other community organisations, we've partnered with the Latrobe City Council to purchase uh, the Latrobe Sports and Entertainment Stadium to make sure that we can refurbish this really important asset that everything on a rectangular pitch from here will be able to take place on really top end facilities with lighting, with a significant calendar of training, of competition and of A grade and elite sporting events. We want to make sure that the history and the tradition of this magnificent facility is preserved. We've seen everything from uh, monster trucks through to, uh, <laughs> through to nitro, through to various other sporting and, and footy and soccer initiatives happen here over the years. We're not going to let that go. What we are going to do though is as part of our commitment in $85 million uh, for the development of elite sporting competition across the Latrobe Valley region, make sure that we have the very best facilities and infrastructure and opportunities, not just to bring elite sports uh, into our region, not just to make sure that we can continue to have our sporting teams showcasing the very best of their own talents, but to provide our local communities with facilities that we can really be proud of. We have a lot to be proud of here in the Latrobe Valley. We are resilient, we are resourceful, we are innovative, we are tight knit and we achieve every single time we are given the opportunity to do so. Today's announcement is one further step in making that happen. 